Hey gearheads, I got called out by everybody to do the cold start challenge, so we're gonna give it a shot. It's only about 42 degrees here above zero, that's Fahrenheit for you Canadians uh, here in Raleigh, North Carolina. So um, I think I moved the Chevelle about four days ago, so uh, let's see if she'll start. A couple hits of the pedal. Of course, she's in the garage, so that may be cheating. So let's go see what the ramp truck looks like outside. So here we are on the side of the house, got the ramp truck over here. We just used it the other day to move Danny B's vehicle for uh, Grimson's tuning. So you wanna check out his channel and see what we were doing over there. Um, but this thing hasn't been ran in a couple days, so let's see what it'll do. So this used to be a mechanical fuel pump and now it's a electric, it's an electric fuel pump. So um, it's a little bit different situation here. So we do have a little switch here. We need to hit for the fuel pump. Oh, the light even works. We'll give it a couple pumps because it is still carbureted. Maybe a couple more pumps. Oh, it wants to go. There she goes. So there you go, I guess uh, 40 degrees really isn't too chilly out here for North Carolina and uh, my vehicles are still running. Um, I may have something without an engine, but you have to tune in for more episodes on that. Speaking of more episodes, since I got your attention and I'm just throwing this out there, I uh, just wanted to say about the 15 cars I bought, it is going to take a while to get them processed. One thing is I only have a two car garage over here, so I can only fit one car here at a time to go ahead and get it processed. The second thing is getting a title does take about six to eight months right now in North Carolina because they're so backed up. I need a title to sell each of these vehicles because I want to make sure that they're all good for you guys to buy them and fix them up. So it is going to take me a while to get through each one of these vehicles. So just be patient with me if there's a certain vehicle you saw in the video that you want to buy or fix up or anything like that. Just keep tuning into the channel and you'll see the episodes of when I get it here and that'll give you a little bit of notice before it goes up for sale on eBay. Um, another thing I wanted to mention is I have a PO box now. So if anybody out there, uh, you have a channel, you got some stickers, you wanna send me some, I'd be glad to promote your channel on my channel. We are working on getting some Dan's Garage decals, some stickers, some shirts, some merch, some all sorts of fun stuff over here. So keep watching for that. And uh, I'll put the link to uh, Danny B's channel in the uh, description below. Some other channels that you should check out if you haven't already subscribed to them. Make sure you're hitting the bell on all of those channels and keep watching for more fun. Thanks for tuning in.